check this out, y'all. Never mind how messy I look and how crazy I look. I'm using my mother's phone because on my phone, I have the Bible app. And on that app, well, I was going through the daily bread and it told me to look at Ephesians 5, right? 5, 1 through 16, 5, 1 through 13. It talks about catching foxes, okay? Right? Catch for us the foxes, the little foxes that rule in the vineyards. And it says, when you're tempted to sin, how can you learn into the Holy Spirit's power to resist? How, what little foxes can the Spirit help you deal with today? Use your power to give me strength to resist sinning and damaging my relationship with you and others. So apparently, I have, my bride's Bible is the New Living Testament, right? However, the King James Version of the Bible has the 50s, 1 through 15. So I feel like that's, some, that's a book out of the Bible that was taken out. And I have proof that it was taken out. So because it goes from Ephesians 4, 4, 23, the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ be with you in spirit. Amen. Final greetings to Colossians, Colossians right? So it goes from Ephesians, this is Ephesians 4, to Colossians 1. So the book, the five, Ephesians 5 is completely taken out of the New Living Trans Testament or the New Living Translation. And it's talking about catching foxes and teaching us how to resist temptation, how to resist tempted te when you're tempted to sin. So it gives us exactly what we should do. So I am going to get into this, although I have to get ready for work. I am, look at me. Um, however... Found something out. I'm like, wow. So I want to do this. I'm about to take a shower and get ready for work real quick and try to get into this because this is insane. I've heard, you know, rumors that there are certain books out the Bible that were taken out in the New Living Testament. So whoever wrote the New Living Testament cut it short and took certain books out the Bible or certain guidance out the Bible for what reason? Huh? We about to dive into it though, but it's talk about how to resist the fox, how to resist temptation when you're tempted to sin, how to lean into the Holy Spirit for power to resist it. People, we about to have a whole schooling on this one, boy.